Welcome to BricsCAD for AutoCAD users. My name is Ralph Grabowski and it is my pleasure to show you BricsCAD 14. AutoCAD has a dozen or so selection modes and you've probably used some of them quite a lot such as Window, Crossing and Select All. BricsCAD has all the same selection modes as AutoCAD plus five more and that's what you'll learn about in this video. The excellent selection modes are known as Outside, which is the opposite of Window, Outside Polygon, which is outside of a polygon window, Window Circle, which is just like Window but using a circle instead of a rectangle, Crossing Circle, like crossing but with a circle, and Outside Circle, the opposite of Window Circle. Let's take now a look at how they work. For reasons that I don't know, AutoCAD only selects objects inside selection boundaries, never outside. Let me show you how outside selection modes work in BricsCAD. Here's a drawing courtesy of Triad Products. It's of a wall-mounted surround sound speaker. I want to move everything except the front view. I start the move command, type O for outside crossing rectangle, select the front view, press enter twice then move the other views. Outside Polygon works the same way. Here I will select the top and side views. First enter the move command, then type OP for outside polygon selection mode, and then I'll click a few points here to select the top and front views, press enter twice, then move the front view. Pretty nifty, eh? Circular section sets are often used in mapping to indicate an equidistant radius of events, such as say a flu outbreak or nuclear bomb explosion. BricsCAD comes with three of them, window, crossing, and outside circle selection, and they all work as you'd expect. I'm going to show you now how the circular selection modes work, starting with the window circle. I'm going to use the change properties command to change the colors of part of this map, the map world map that was provided by cadperson.net. I'm going to use the change properties command, which is chprop. It's prompting me to select energies to change, so I type in WC, short for dub window circle, press enter. It asks me for a center of the circle, so I'll click, and then it asks for a radius of the circle, click. Press enter to end entity selection mode. Now I'm going to change the color to red. Press enter and that circular area of country boundaries is now red. Next I'll use the outside circle selection mode to color most of the rest of the map in green. So repeat the change properties command by hitting the space bar. It's prompting me to select entities to change. So this time I'll enter in OC. Not for Orange County, the TV show, but for outside circle selection mode. Press enter. It's prompting me again for the center of the circle. Click and a radius. Click. Press enter. And now we're going to specify the color green instead. And there you have it. Uh, three circular areas in three different colors. Red, black, and green. So there you have it, the extra selection modes from BricsCAD, not available in AutoCAD, outside and circular. Download the free trial version of BricsCAD at www.brixis.com and check it out for yourself.